the Insteon homes or smart home uh, devices to control a lot of things in my house. And one of the things that I use it to control is my garage door. And so here's the app and we can see that the red light here is on my garage door bay one, which is this one. And so here's the new garage door opener. It's pretty nice, belt driven, craftsman. And if we look up the ceiling, you can see the Insteon garage controller. And it has a little sensor that goes to it. Um, and that's why it's red, so we can see that it's working. Um, the problem is, it doesn't work with this garage door opener. Let's show you. So we'll select it, I'll hit off. We can hear that flashed, but nothing happened. The door didn't go down. Here's on, clicked again, nothing happened. So I'm gonna show you how to wire the Insteon garage door controller into the remote. Because the, here's the other thing. The wall mount controller is a multi function uh, controller. So, you know, we flip this up and you can see there's a lot of other things in there. Uh, so it's not just the normal on off, which is typical for the garage. You know, you just have like two or three buttons, open and close, um, a light on and then a lock. This has got a lot of other features to it. So there's a lot of other signals that go across those wires, <coughs> which causes a conflict with the little remote connection in here. So I'm going to take apart a controller where one of the remote controls, I should say, it comes with a three button controller. Let's see, uh, like this guy right here. And this is already programmed for the garage. Uh, the center one here is programmed for this left side. That was the right side. And the middle one I have programmed to control both doors. So what I'm going to do is take apart one of these controllers and hook the Insteon up to the controller to control the garage door opener. And this is how I did it. So here's the garage door opener after it's been installed. And this is the quick model number, uh, 139.54915. Here's a close-up of the remotes on the wall. Here's the handheld remote control. And here's the Insteon on the ceiling. So the first thing I did was carefully take apart the remote. And then I held it up so I could see the pins as a, uh, so I could see where the, you know, the connections are, the, the shorts, uh, the open to close rather for the button that is getting pressed because it's just a, um, a single on and off, uh, open close type switch. So once I identified those, then I, I knew that I just needed to connect the top one to the bottom section. And once I did that, then I could control the garage door opener. So I warmed up the soldering iron and got a little piece of wire uh, that was left over from doing the install of the garage, garage door opener. And then um, here's a close-up of what I'm going to be doing, soldering the wire onto those two areas. And here it is after it's soldered on. And I went ahead and I notched the box so that um, the wires would fit through without being pinched. And because I'm going to keep the box uh, on it, obviously, to protect it. And then uh, I installed the circuit board back into the remote you can see that the wire passes through that notch and closed it all up and this is what it looked like. And then I disconnected the uh, Insteon garage door opener control from the um, red and white uh, on the left there uh, contacts for the wall mounted remote. And I connected them to the um, Insteon, or I connected the Insteon to the um, remote control that we just uh, soldered. And here's the wrap up. Now with everything hooked up, you can see there, right, let's go ahead and give it a test. Got my app open. Red light means the garage bay is open. And we will just hit off. And now the red light's off, it's closed, and then let's open it.
there we go. So in order to get it to work, you gotta hack the uh, little uh, remote. And it seemed pretty easy, it took all of a couple of minutes. Hope this helps uh, everybody out there get their Insteon garage uh, hooked up to these new garage door openers. Good luck.